SNN. Today is Monday, April 30th, 2012. It is a sky day, which means star periods 1, 3, and 5. Heard it on the grapevine, today is National Raisin Day. It all started in 1873 when a freak hot spell weathered the grapes on the vine. One enterprising San Francisco grocer advertised these shriveled grapes as Peruvian delicacies, and the rest is history. It takes more than four tons of grapes to produce one ton of raisins. The finest raisins come from Mal Malaga in Spain. Raisin comes from the Latin racemus and means a cluster of grapes or berries. Grape news for Fresno, California. They are the raisin capital of the world. Also, a good day for land. Have I got a deal for you. Really? Sure. It's a great piece of property. It was sort of a swamp land, too. Swamp land? Yeah. On this day, in 1803, France agreed to sell the Louisiana Territory to the United States. How much did that encompass? It's the territory of the western United States from the Mississippi River to the Rocky Mountains between the Gulf of Mexico and the Canadian border. What was the price? Fifteen million, doubling the size of the U.S. Eight years later, on the same date, Louisiana became the 18th state. It was also an area officially explored by the Lewis and Clark Expedition. They are, they are just beginning the, of America's fascination with exploring the West. <laughs> it was the new frontier. Hey, Skyridge Track has some experience with Frontier. Yeah, Frontier Middle School Track Team. The Hawks soared their way through the competition, and they don't let anything get in their way. They had a great meet last week, especially for the first one of the season. Today, we have the scores. Usually, the first one has a big learning curve, but the score of 384 to 215 only shows their confidence. Mr. Condon says, all in all, the kids did awesome. The first home meet is this Thursday, May 3rd. Staff, track needs to help out. If you have parents or older brothers and sisters that would like to come help out, have them contact Mr. Condon. Again, congrats to the track team members who won 384 to 215 over Frontier. Catch this news, football. Today, at first and second lunch, football, you can meet with the CHS coaches about what? Football! football. That's today, first and second lunch. I think we're showing a video in the cafeteria also. About what? Football. Cream puffs. Mixed salad. Chocolate croissants. Honeydew. You should go to the CHS Health and Wellness Athletics and Activities Fair, dear. When? Tuesday, May 8th from 6 to 8 p.m. at the Camas High School. This year it's two events into one big night full of extraordinary and unique ways to live long and prosper. You will be able to talk with CHS club advisors and coaches. Plus, you can visit vendors in booths with info and more. More CHS news open to current 8th graders. Be a paper shaker. That's the CHS <laughs> dance team, the paper shakers. CHS dance team tryout packets are in the main office now. Tryout dates are coming up, so mark your calendars. Here, here they are, May 10th from 3 to 6 p.m. May 11th from 6.30 to 8.30 p.m. May 12th, which is a Saturday, from 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. It's time to make a movie. A little one. A short. Two minutes or less. It's time for the Let's Move Clark County Youth Video Contest. This flyer, available on the LMC right now, has all the details and looks. The deadline for submission is May 31st. There will be, a fi there will be five winners, so why not give your video a chance? Get the flyer and start creating. The end of April. Wow, where did the month go? The month has come to an end. Well, you know, its days are numbered. Every calendar's days are numbered. Monday, it's Monday and it's Pun Day. April was also National Poetry Month. A chicken crossing the road is poultry in motion. When a clock is hungry, it goes back for seconds. Have a great last day of April. Oh, our flex rotations start today. So make sure you know where you're going and be on time. Today's thought. When all is said and done, more is said than done. Do great stuff today. Start by following the Sky Code, which means be safe, be respectful, and be responsible. This has been Madison and Isabella. At this time, please stand for the pledge. Ready? Begin.